सो हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल आई होप यू गाइज आर डूइंग ग्रेट सो टूडे इज वीडियो वी आर गोन टॉक अबाउट हाउ वी कैन एड दी लाइटिंग इन टू आर की बोर्ड्स बटन एंड विल ऑल्सो टॉक अबाउट हाउ वी कैन एनिमेट दोज लाइट विद द हेल्प ऑफ द ब्लेंडोर सो विदाउट एनी फर्दर डिले नाउ लेट्स गेट स्टार्ट यू टूटोरियल एंड इन दिस वीडियो यू ऑल्सो गेट सम टिप्स एंड ट्रिक्स सो मेक श्योर यू वॉच दिस टूटोरियल टिल एंड सो ना लेट स्टार्ट दी टूटोरियल so all that guys here you can see we have a new project file and right now we don't have any kind of lighting into our keyboard's button so for adding the light first of all we have to select that object where we need a light by the way so what i'm going to do first of all i will just select my keyboard buttons basically so here you can see we have a uh, these buttons which is i have joined in a one mesh and here you can see we have a final one mesh so what i'm going to do first of all i'm just going to hide everything apart from this uh, shape by the way and right now here you can see we have a uh, that kind of shape here so what i'm going to do first of all i will just change this uh, material as a emission yeah something like that and right now here you can see we can't see any kind of changing happening in this scene but if i will just switch into my shading panel and here i will just use some nodes so we'll we'll able to see some changes happening here by the way so what we have to do exactly we have to just add one uh, color ramp here by the way okay and after adding the color ramp i'm just going to plug this color into a color something like that and i will just change the color from here by the way uh, first one i will take a red and second one i will choose a little bluish okay but right now here you can see we'll just able to see only mid color of both color by the way but which is we don't want so what we have to do we have change the option only rgb as a hsv and right now here you can see we don't have any kind of changes yet but if i will just change as a near as a far so now here you can see when i'm just going to move my fac so right now we have a colorful lighting here and which is look cool by the way and hide everything and now here you can see we have a that kind of lighting here and which is look cool by the way okay so now here you can see we have a lighting into our keyboard but still we are unable to see any kind of glare any kind of lighting effect here so for that what we have to do we have to just go to our render properties and from here we have to just enable the bloom and when we will enable the bloom so now right now here you can see we have a little glare here but we don't have any kind of glare into our keyboards and which is not look realistic by the way so first of all we have to just increase the strength from here and here you can see guys when i increase the strength now we have a good glare also here and which is look more realistic okay so now we'll just animate this and for animating this lighting what we have to do first of all i'm just gonna decrease this uh, fac into a zero and i will just uh, go to my timeline panel and i have already switched my this panel as a timeline okay you can also switch from here by the way so i'm just going to my first frame okay and here i will just hover my mouse on the top of this fac and i will just press the i and right now here you can see we have a one keyframe here okay so now what i'm going to do i'm just going to my 25 frame yeah and i will just i'm just going to increase this fac into one and again i will just press the i and again we have a new keyframe now again i will just go to my 50th frame and i will just uh, decrease again this fac into a zero and again i will just press the i so now here you can see when i'm just going to play the animation so we will able to see that kind of animation happening here and which is look nice by the way okay guys so now i'm just going to switch into my layout section and now here you can see if i'm just going to play the animation so now we have a animated keyboard here and which is look nice by the way so here you can see guys that's how you can animate your um, keyboard lighting with the help of the color ramp and which is easy and cool trick so i thought i should share with you so thanks for watching this video guys if you learn something in this video please hit the like button the share button and subscribe my channel also if you have any queries if you have any session please let me know in the comment box i will definitely reply comment so bye bye take care and stay home guys